Right, um, you've just kind of caught up with me after I finish that boss. Uh, I couldn't take doing it anymore, so I used all the TNT that Pugsley gave me. Um, just spammed it with the TNT, basically. Um, God, that's annoying. So, sorry about having another shitty video. Um, it's going to turn into a bit of a habit by the looks of things. Because uh, there's plenty more bosses to come. So, get used to rubbish. I did get rather frustrated there. If any of you are offended by bad language or angry men, then I don't recommend keeping watching. Because this game is only going to get a lot worse. Um, I probably will do some Let's Plays of absolutely pathetic things. Even then, you know, I'll probably swear about something, go on a rant about something. It's got absolutely crazy. Look, it's just a... It, it's... I'm not taking that. I'm not accepting that hit. That's just unacceptable. Sometimes I wonder why I bother playing games, you know, I always get angry at them. PlayStation games was always my bane. As soon as the PlayStation era came about, and everyone suddenly wanted to make the next big platformer, when you had things like Crash Bandicoot and things like that coming out, and it was always about the well-timed jump. Well-timed jumps broke so many PS1 controllers in my house. Unbelievable. Tekken 2. Final few bosses, you know, you'd, you'd work for ages, you'd be really easy getting there, and then all of a sudden you get battered. You just go crazy, throw a control. Anger's all part and parcel of video games, I think. I think if you don't get angry with them, there's something wrong with you. Because, I mean, realistically, most of them are made far too hard. You know, they're far too difficult for the purpose which they serve, which is essentially to have fun. You know, when you're trying to have fun and you've got a thousand gobstoppers coming at you, what am I supposed to do here? And I've picked up a pink gun thing. Right. That's it. That's it for this for now. That's it. I can't take any more. I really can't. This game was easy when I was like seven. One life. It's one of those annoying one life games where where you you die and that's it. Oh, do I get to play again? No, sorry, nope, nope. I mean, you can hit the continue, but I'm pretty certain you start off from the very beginning. In which case, you've got to get all the way back to where you were. <sighs> If you think now we have games where you can just save wherever you like. In Fallout 3 I can save the exact moment before I want to try something or do something different in case it goes wrong. You know, and then I just load up again. It's, it's, a, it's a matter of time wasted. Now what's the point in sitting down playing a game for two hours if you're only going to fuck it up and that time will have been just absolutely futilely spent doing nothing. Achieving nothing. I mean, games inherently are about spending time doing nothing, but... I don't know. 